Senegalese born and former French footballer Jean Pierre Adams died at the age of 73 in France. Almost 40 years of his life, however, was spent in a vegetative state. He was in a coma for a whopping 39 years. How did this happen? In March 1982, he was admitted to a hospital for knee surgery, which is actually not a serious condition when compared to other deadly diseases and life threatening injuries. Jean Pierre Adams had tendon damage in his knees and was lined up for an operation at Edward Herriot Hospital in Lyon. The majority of the hospital staff were on strike, leaving a few heads at the medical facility. The anesthetist was taking care of eight patients at the same time and he was assisted by a trainee. Errors occurred and Jean Pierre Adams was struck with cardiac arrest and brain damage, putting him in a coma. What happened was that Jean-Pierre Adams was badly intubated as one of the tubes inserted blocked the pathway to his lungs, depriving him of oxygen, leading to cardiac arrest and brain damage. The trainee at the hospital admitted that he was inadequate to the task. In the 1990s, the anesthetist and the trainee were given a one-month suspended sentence and fined $815, which per some statistical analysis is about $1,702 in our year of 2021. Jean Pierre Adams' condition was hopeless, and after 15 months, he was discharged from the hospital and taken home. He was married to a French woman, Bernadette Adams. She took care of her husband until his death on September 6, 2021. And when we are talking about care, we mean daily care. She changed his clothes, prepared food and fed him, and even bought him presents. She talked to him daily. Although there was no response from her comatose husband, she never gave up. She refused calls to implement euthanasia, which in simple terms mean turning off the life support machine of the husband and continued to be that devoted wife to her husband. She took care of her husband for 39 years until his death. Bernadette Adams is the very epitome of for better for worse. What do you think about this devoted wife? Let us have a discussion in the comment section and don't forget to like and subscribe.